Whatever you're saying, whatever you're doing, everything is in the now. Hey, my name is Christina Guberman. I am an international TV presenter and model. I think the hardest question for me to answer has always been, where are you from? I never know what to say. I've lived in so many different countries, speak so many different languages, so I'm very open-minded to everything. My parents are originally Russian, so I spoke Russian growing up, and then I went to an international school. I've also lived in south of France for a few years, and then I moved to Italy. Now I speak English, Russian, French, and Italian fluently. And I'm currently learning Spanish as well, which is coming along very smoothly. Fingers crossed I will be able to speak five languages fluently soon. Yay! <laughs> Although I have always said I want to know six. I've always enjoyed drawing and painting from a very young age, but slowly morphed into designing clothing by the time I was a teenager. I went to university in Milan to study fashion design, and it was there that I realized just how much precision and effort goes into tailoring every single piece of clothing we buy. Really mind-blowing, actually. That's what made me want to pursue that sector and combine it with the presenting aspect of things, which is exactly what I've done by presenting fashion on QVC channel in the UK. I love working on live TV. It's always extremely challenging because you always have to be thinking on your feet. There is no room for error. Everything gets broadcast. Whatever you're saying, whatever you're doing, everything is in the now. But I think the more you do it, the more fun it gets and the more free and relaxed you become. Just the process itself has been incredibly enjoyable. Just come back from the French Riviera. <laughs> For me, the most memorable part about being a TV presenter is anything that includes traveling. So I spent about a year living in Africa just presenting travel, wildlife, and conservation TV shows that are now airing worldwide. This is so incredible. I've also been all around Germany presenting the coolest parts of the country to be in and what there is to do, to see, the best food to eat. It really has been a dream come true. Modeling, you get many, many takes because during a photo shoot, you'll easily take 300, 500 photos. Whereas during presenting, especially on live TV, you only get that one shot. That's why I think presenting for me is a little bit more challenging and I often enjoy it more than modeling, but I think both definitely have their rewards. I initially wanted to start an OnlyFans page so that I could better connect with the viewers for my TV shows and also just my followers on social media. The fact that I don't have to go into an office and work 9 to 5 to be able to monetize on what I do has just been life-changing, really. My OnlyFans page is a nice mix of everything. It's got a lot of lifestyle content from my life here in Monaco, definitely a lot of travel vlogs, fashion shows, swimwear shoots, and other photo shoots that I don't post elsewhere. There's a lot of gym and fitness content. And the most important thing I think is the one-on-one -on -one interaction that I get with each and every user that joins. I will never leave a message unread. I'll always respond. Starting from this year, I've actually launched a VIP section. So this is for my top subscribers who want even more exclusive content. The right way uh, for doing that is just by joining the VIP section. Dream big, keep smiling, and obviously come subscribe to my profile if you haven't done so yet. Thank you.